success. We continue to get reports about the Bailey Boswell trial. Are we on, uh, Dave, what are we on right now? What day are we on? Day nine. This is day yes. nine of the Bailey Boswell trial. Thank you. That's the voice of Dave Schroeder. I'm Scott Foster. As we continue to look at this um, historic trial that's taking place here in Dawson County, and uh, can they continued with some technology stuff over yesterday right Dave? absolutely and i make that correction is day 10 day actually 10. i day just uh, added again in my head but yes digital data and so forth that's uh, playing a key role in this trial it seems uh they went over some more cell phone data mm -hmm. uh, around the time of the uh, 14th 15th and 16th and 17th uh tracking the phones that are registered to bailey boswell two of them and also one to aubrey trail and just kind of tracking those movements of those uh, cell phones around. And of course they uh, uh, tracked them around Lincoln as they uh, went to the uh, hardware stores and picked up uh, supplies and also uh, to Wilbur. Uh, they had some uh, surveillance or store receipt at least of uh, Miss Boswell allegedly purchasing items like Clorox and Drano of uh, even hours uh, before that uh, Boswell was meeting with Sidney Loof on that second date. And of course, uh, Sidney was never seen or heard from after that. So Dave, can I ask you, that, are they concentrating these, uh, the cell phone, the things that they're finding, the things that they were talking about yesterday on after, after Loof has been uh, found as missing? So are they looking at that time span or are they looking at the lead up to it? Well, the, the lead up and the time of, I, okay. I would say. Um, of course, they cover the movements afterwards and trying to locate that in uh, previous days of the trial. And so, so now they're focusing on that and even the movements of those cell phones uh, the day after when uh, the um, remains were allegedly left behind in Clay County. Now, you said that they also talked a little bit about surveillance video. Is that right? Yeah, they had surveillance video of... Uh, of uh, the two at the Home Depot in uh, Lincoln, as they were purchasing uh, drop cloths, uh, hacksaw blades, and a box cutter knife there. And, uh, but uh, the defense attorney uh, kind of uh, tried to put a little bit of a notch in there because it, the surveillance video didn't show who actually picked up and put those items in the grocery carts. So. Okay. Okay. But uh, put that idea of doubt. Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. So uh, there was about eight uh, witnesses called yesterday by the uh, state. The state's uh, case continues and certainly a lot more ahead uh, in this coming week of the state's case. Uh, as I mentioned before, uh, we haven't got to the autopsy. We haven't got to the uh, testimony of three young women who allegedly had relationships uh, with the uh, Aubrey Trail and uh, Bailey Boswell as well. Okay. All right. So a lot more to come. Day 10 of the Bailey Boswell trial. We're, we're on day 10 right now. Correct? Absolutely. In Dawson County District Court in Lexington and our own Bob Brogan is there at the courthouse today. So be listening for more reports from Bob and we'll get you caught up as things go on. Thank you, Dave. I appreciate it.